We're back here in the field where we've been studying what chain roll compared to confetti roll would look like. And so this area might look familiar to you because we did a lot of video work here through the growing season. But today is harvest. And as right before we take the combine through here to get some yield checks, I thought it'd be good to review what we talked about, late emergers, due to the fact that the confetti roll puts a lot of small debris and residue in and the row cleaners can't clean it out. The total symptoms of that, well, you can see the symptoms of that by looking at the base of the plant. This would be a normal size diameter. Then immediately you see two late emergers and you see the small diameter and then back to a normal diameter. So as the planter came through here, it was struggling. Lots of fines and you can see them yet. There's still a lot of evidence of that here on the ground itself. And you can see a lot of this small residue that the row cleaners couldn't clean out. So if we come up on this plant that has a small diameter, it's a late emerger, and we're just gonna pick some ears here. And we'll just lay them down. And this, this is what we talk about when we say, attention to detail. And so the chain roll is all about creating residue, but not creating small ears. And so as we lay the ears down here, we can see there's quite a different size. And so when I hold those two up for you in my hand, you can see where the difference is. So in a few minutes, we'll run the combine through here and we'll note the difference. But the fact remains for you and I, we want a harvestable size ear out of every seed. And when we get this, it's half of what we expect. And so for a corn on corn field, we're looking for every plant to put on an ear like this. And we have this smaller ear due to the fact that the planter couldn't handle the residue because of the small size and it set on a much smaller ear.